The alpha-2 alpha adrenergic receptor, or adrenoceptor, is a G-protein coupled receptor GPCR, associated with the G heterotrimeric G protein. It consists of three highly homologous subtypes, including alpha-2A, alpha-2B, and alpha-2C adrenergic. Some species other than humans express a fourth alpha-2D adrenergic receptor as well. Catecholamines like norepinephrine noradrenaline and epinephrine adrenaline signal through the alpha-2 adrenergic receptor in the central and peripheral nervous systems. Cellular localization The alpha-2A adrenergic receptor is localized in the following central nervous system CNS, structures Brainstem, especially the locus ceruleus Midbrain Hypothalamus Hippocampus Spinal cord Cerebral cortex Cerebellum Septum Whereas the alpha-2B adrenergic receptor is localized in the following CNS structures Olfactory system Thalamus Pyramidal layer of the hippocampus Cerebellar Purkinje layer and the alpha 2C adrenergic receptor is localized in the CNS structures. Midbrain, thalamus, amygdala, dorsal root ganglia, olfactory system, hippocampus, cerebral cortex, basal ganglia. Substantia nigra Ventral tegmentum Effects The alpha-2 adrenergic receptor is classically located on vascular prejunctional terminals where it inhibits the release of norepinephrine noradrenaline in a form of negative feedback. It is also located on the vascular smooth muscle cells of certain blood vessels, such as those found in skin arterioles or on veins, where it sits alongside the more plentiful alpha-1 adrenergic receptor. The alpha-2 adrenergic receptor binds both norepinephrine released by sympathetic postganglionic fibers and epinephrine adrenaline released by the adrenal medulla, binding norepinephrine with slightly higher affinity. It has several general functions in common with the alpha-1 adrenergic receptor, but also has specific effects of its own. Agonists activators of the alpha-2 adrenergic receptor are frequently used in veterinary anesthesia where they affect sedation, muscle relaxation and analgesia through effects on the central nervous system CNS. General Common effects include Suppression of release of norepinephrine noradrenaline by negative feedback. Transient hypertension, increase in blood pressure, followed by a sustained hypotension, decrease in blood pressure. Vasoconstriction of certain arteries. Vasoconstriction of arteries to heart, coronary artery. However, the extent of this effect may be limited and may be negated by the vasodilatory effect from beta-2 receptors. Constriction of some vascular smooth muscle Venoconstriction of veins Decrease motility of smooth muscle in gastrointestinal tract Inhibition of lipolysis Facilitation of the cognitive functions associated with the prefrontal cortex PFC, working memory, attention, executive functioning, etc. Sedation Analgesia Individual Individual actions of the alpha-2 receptor include Mediates synaptic transmission in pre- and postsynaptic nerve terminals Decrease release of acetylcholine Decrease release of norepinephrine Inhibit norepinephrine system in brain Inhibition of lipolysis in adipose tissue Inhibition of insulin release in pancreas Induction of glucagon release from pancreas Platelet aggregation 
Contraction of sphincters of the gastrointestinal tract Decreased secretion from salivary gland Relax gastrointestinal tract presynaptic effect. Decreased aqueous humor fluid production from the ciliary body Signaling cascade the alpha subunit of an inhibitory G protein, D dissociates from the G protein, and associates with adenylyl cyclase. This causes the inactivation of adenylyl cyclase, resulting in a decrease of CAMP produced from ATP, which leads to a decrease of intracellular CAMP. PKA is not able to be activated by CAMP, so proteins such as phosphorylase kinase cannot be phosphorylated by PKA. In particular, phosphorylase kinase is responsible for the phosphorylation and activation of glycogen phosphorylase, an enzyme necessary for glycogen breakdown. Thus in this pathway, the downstream effect of adenylyl cyclase inactivation is decreased breakdown of glycogen. The relaxation of gastrointestinal tract motility is by presynaptic inhibition, where transmitters inhibit further release by homotropic effects. Ligands. Agonists Partial agonists Antagonists Agonists Norepinephrine has higher affinity for the alpha-2 receptor than has epinephrine, and therefore relates less to the latter's functions. Non-selective agonists include the antihypertensive drug clonidine, used to lower blood pressure and hot flashes associated with menopausal symptoms. Clonidine has also been successfully used in indications that exceed what would be expected from a simple blood pressure lowering drug. It has recently shown positive results in children with ADHD who suffer from tics resulting from the treatment with a CNS stimulant drug, such as Adderall XR or methylphenidate. Clonidine also helps alleviate symptoms of opioid withdrawal. The hypotensive effect of clonidine was initially attributed through its agonist action on presynaptic alpha-2 receptors, which act as a down regulator on the amount of norepinephrine released in the synaptic cleft, an example of autoreceptor. However, it is now known that clonidine binds to imidazoline receptors with a much greater affinity than alpha-2 receptors, which would account for its applications outside the field of hypertension alone. Amidazoline receptors occur in the nucleus tractus solitary and also the centrolateral medulla. Clonidine is now thought to decrease blood pressure via this central mechanism. Other non-selective agonists include dexmedetomidin, lofexidine, another antihypertensive, TDIQ, partial agonist, tizanidine in spasms, cramping, and xylazine. Xylazine has veterinary use. In the European Union, dexmedetomidin received a marketing authorization from the European Medicines Agency EMA, on August 10, 2012 under the brand name of Dextor. It is indicated for sedation in the ICU for patients needing mechanical ventilation. In non-human species this is an immobilizing and anesthetic drug, presumptively also mediated by alpha-2 adrenergic receptors because it is reversed by yahimbine, an alpha-2 antagonist. Alpha-2A selective agonists include guanfacine an antihypertensive and bromonidine UK 14304 R-3 nitrobiphenylene is an alpha-2C selective agonist. Antagonists Non-selective alpha blockers include A80426, adipamazole, phenoxybenzamine, efaroxin, idazoxin asterisk, experimental SB269970 and yahimbine asterisk, a treatment for erectile dysfunction. Tetracyclic antidepressants mirtazapine and meonserin are also potent alpha antagonists with mirtazapine being more selective for alpha-2 subtype approximately 30-fold selective over alpha-1 than meonserin approximately 17-fold. Alpha-2A selective blockers include minus 44,408 Brazilian reals and Rx minus 821,002. Alpha-2B selective blockers include ARC-239 and imaloxin. Alpha-2C selective blockers include JP1302 and spiroxetrine, the latter also being a serotonin 5-HT1A antagonist. 
See also Adrenergic receptor References External links Adrenoceptors IUPHAR Database of Receptors and Ion Channels. International Union of Basic and Clinical Pharmacology.